mighty tech users, I hope you all are doing fine. You all must have heard about the words database and database management system. Today's video is to give you an idea about data, database, and database management systems. Before moving on to what is database, I would like to tell you a little bit about data. So, what is data? The word data is originated from the word datum, that means single piece of information. It is plural of the word datum. In simple words, data can be facts related to any object in consideration. For example, your name, age, height, weight, etc. are some data related to you. Computer data is information processed or stored by a computer. This information may be in the form of text documents, images, audio clips, software programs, or other types of data. Computer data may be processed by the computer's CPU and is stored in files and folders on the computer's hard disk. A picture, image, file, PDF, etc. can also be considered data. At its most rudimentary level, computer data is a bunch of ones and zeros, known as binary data. Because all computer data is in binary format, it can be created, processed, saved and stored digitally this allows data to be transferred from one computer to another using a network connection or various media devices it also does not deteriorate over time or lose quality after being used multiple times so now you know that what is data now we will move on to what is database a database is a systematic collection of data they support electronic storage and manipulation of data databases make data management easy you can organize data into tables rows columns and index it to make it easier to find relevant information. Database handlers create a database in such a way that only one set of software program provides access of data to all the users. The main purpose of the database is to operate a large amount of information by storing, retrieving, and managing data. There are many dynamic websites on the World Wide Web nowadays which are handled through databases. For example, a model that checks the availability of rooms in a hotel. It is an example of a dynamic website that uses a database. Let us discuss another database example. An online telephone directory uses a database to store data of people, phone numbers, and other contact details. Your electricity service provider uses a database to manage billing, client-related issues, handle fault data, etc. Let us also consider Facebook. It needs to store, manipulate, and present data related to members, their friends, member activities, messages, advertisements, and a lot more. We can provide a countless number of examples for the usage of databases. There are many databases available like MySQL, Sybase, Oracle, MongoDB, Informix, PostgreSQL, SQL Server, etc. Modern databases are managed by the Database Management System or DBMS. We will discuss more about databases and the database management systems in upcoming videos. If you want to get a summary of data science and big data, then we have dedicated two entire videos for both. You can check them out by clicking